Hello everyone, I am Dr. Shireen and welcome back to my new video. So in today's video, we are going to talk about discoloration of teeth. Why do you have stains in your teeth? What are the causes and what are the treatments that are available? So let's get straight to the video. Now, aesthetics plays an important factor in our everyday lives nowadays because everybody loves to look good. So the most common question that patients ask is, how can we whiten our teeth? Are there any home remedies for whitening our teeth? Or can we just use a whitening toothpaste to whiten our teeth? Or can we use charcoal for whitening our teeth? So the answers to all your questions are in this video, so keep on watching. Now firstly, no, there are no home remedies for whitening your teeth. And secondly, you do not use a charcoal for whitening your teeth. Please do not use a, a charcoal for scrubbing your teeth or brushing your teeth because not only will charcoal destroy your teeth, but it will also destroy the surrounding structure that is the gums. So the color of our teeth will depend upon certain factors. So first, the color of our teeth will depend upon the thickness and the translucency of the topmost layer that is the enamel. Then it will also depend upon the color and the thickness of the underlying dentine that is the second layer. As well as it will depend upon the color of the living tissue that is the pulp. So we must also keep in mind that with age, teeth do discolor. The reason for this is with age, the topmost layer or the enamel gets eroded or abraded off. So it gets thinned out with time. As well as with age, the dentine or the underlying dentine becomes thickened due to the deposition of what we call secondary dentine as well as a tertiary dentine. So due to these reasons, teeth may also discolor. Discoloration of our teeth is mainly because of stains. Now, stains are of two types. One is called as the intrinsic stain and the other one is called as the extrinsic stains. Now, extrinsic stains or extrinsic discolorations are mostly this, those stains which are found on the outermost layer, that is the enamel, mostly because of tobacco or high intake of coffee, tea, uh, wine. These can also cause stains in your teeth. So, extrinsic stains are mostly bound to the outermost layer, that is the enamel, so, uh, so we can clean them easily. Now we come to intrinsic discoloration or the intrinsic stains. Now these stains are mostly found within the internal tooth structure itself. Now the reason for this is uh, they contain a certain material which we call it as a chromogenic material. Now this material produces color within the tooth structure. So when this material gets incorporated during the tooth development or when the tooth starts to erupt, then it produces discoloration in your teeth. So the most common intrinsic stain is fluorosis. Now fluorosis is mainly caused due to high intake of fluoride during the tooth development. So due to this, it can also cause staining in your teeth. Now we also have stains which are caused due to a certain antibiotic like tetracycline. Now how is this staining caused? Now, so when the fetus is still in the womb, the mother might have taken a certain antibiotic. So due to this reason, it can cause staining in the child's teeth. As well as we have some developmental defects in the tooth itself, uh, like in the cases of amylogenesis imperfecta, we have certain stainings which are caused in the teeth. So we also have stains which are caused due to trauma or accidents. Here we see that the blood vessels that are present in the living tissue that, that is in the pulp, they get ruptured. So due to this, they can also cause discoloration. So we also have stains which are caused due to a certain filling material, uh, especially that of silver amalgam. Now it imparts color to your teeth, but this is reduced nowadays because we use a certain protective layer, which we call it as a liner or base before placing the filling material. So in this way, it has reduced in producing discoloration of your teeth. So what are the treatments that are available for this? Can you use a whitening toothpaste for it? So I would suggest you meet a dentist or you consult a dentist before you use any of the products that are available in the market uh, as well as do not follow any of the uh, DIYs that you normally see in the internet nowadays because so they will not only work but they will also destroy your surrounding structures. So do consult a dentist for this but depending on the cause for the discoloration the dentist is going to treat it accordingly. So now if it's an extrinsic discoloration, then the treatment for it is just scaling and polishing during oral prophylaxis. That will be necessary to 
clean or to remove all the stains followed by good oral hygiene and if it's an intrinsic discoloration or intrinsic stain then uh, we have certain procedures such as bleaching now in bleaching they will apply a certain chemical agent to your teeth so in that way it will not only remove the stains but it will also lighten the color of your teeth now with this i will end the video i hope you found it useful thank you for watching remember to like share comment and subscribe to my youtube channel and also do not forget to turn on the bell notification to never miss my videos because i post my videos um, two times in a week so that is on sunday as well as on a wednesday so do not miss my videos and i will see you in my next video remember to take care guys and stay home stay safe bye